Hey there! Today I'm showing you a beautiful apple plantation my brother and I visited. We were so lucky that a guy gave lots of apples away for free. The only thing he said was that we were responsible for harvesting them ourselves. So as I always wanted to harvest fruits and vegetables on my own, I was super happy to be allowed to harvest them. So I kinda pushed my brother to drive there the same day. And yeah, look how many apples there are. Most of them were just fallen on the ground and my brother even got one on his head. And yeah, it was definitely like in a movie. <laughs> We brought some baskets and bags and harvested for a good two hours. At first my family and I cleaned them the row, means we put water and two tablespoons of natron in a bowl, left them 20 minutes in there and it's good for cleaning everything of them, especially dirt but also insects and worms. While I've waited for them to clean, I looked for storage utensils and found some in the cupboard. Make sure they are cleaned as well and before you fill them, pour hot water in them. Then we cut them, mostly without the peel, because many apples fell on the ground as they were ripe. Some of them went into a big pot to make apple sauce or stewed fruit. Some of them went into our juicer. It works with water steam from the bottom, heating the apples up in the upper part of the juicer. And it's said that it's a method to preserve lots of vitamin. Here are some pics of my brother's mini apple pie. My brother told me several times to include them. So yeah, here are they and they are ready to get eaten. By the way, they are very delicious. My juice took really really long, at least 12 hours or so. So I got really impatient after already 2 hours. And I was a bit disappointed that I only got some bottles full of apple juice, like 4 of them. So that was my little apple harvest. I just wanted to share how diverse apples are, how many things we can do with them and show that it can be really fun to harvest your own food and process it. it I felt a little bit more connected with nature while doing it and felt thankful for having so much to eat. I hope you enjoyed this video and maybe we see each other in the next